what's up? Wood here with my brother, Nats. So as you know, we've been on adventures before. He's the man responsible for the baddest, biggest, meanest monster truck in Asia. And that's huge. And I'm here with the Dream Team. Check out the Dream Team. What's up, boys? So I'm here, there's my boy Joey, and there's the rest of the Dream Team. We are here today on a special four x four clinic, right? So my brother and I, I'm here just supporting him. I'm his supporting cast, probably his uh, beast that I'll run around the jungles and they have to try to find me in a four wheel drive. No, that's a scary idea. Let's not do that. But today we've got a bunch of trucks. Check this out. Woo! There's some sweet rides. This man and I, we're gonna help folks learn how to figure out how to get the most fun, right brother? So he's the, he's the expert. So bro. We have a trailer, right? Later. We're gonna... <laughs> so there's gonna be a, a trail that goes but around this bukit. This is a beautiful spot. Where are we at again, brother? Uh, Eden, Eden. We're in the Eden area. So anyway, I'm here, Wood Jungle Boy, with my brother, the Poggy one. <laughs> We're ready to rock and roll. Let's go. And there's the dream team. Say, what's up, boys? Hey. We're ready. Okay, we're gonna uh, we're gonna grab some breakfast. Yeah. Do a little word. Get into the truth. Do a little worship, and then get muddy. Yeah. I think that's the idea. Right. All right. Well, we'll see you guys. See you. Check out the dream team. They are stuffing their faces. <laughs> They're professional stuffers. <laughs> and that's how we start our morning. That's right. They're doing it. I'm playing the guitar. You know, I'm serenading their stomachs so that they got themselves some proper meals in them. You know, does that feel good? <laughs> This is the whole crew right here today in the 4x4 club. This is awesome. My quick message is this. God is able to redeem. If you knew my father, you would know that there's a God. We had a house, but we didn't have a home, right? It was a very broken environment. But God redeemed that man. And it was because of him turning to Christ that I began to look at my own life and go, man, if Mr. Wick can give his life to God and have a fully transformed life, all of us have hope. None of us deserve the grace of God. It's by his blood that he's purchased a relationship for us to come back to the Father. My father's testimony really shows the parable of the lost. He was lost both at home and far away, trust me. But God redeemed him. My father had a business in 65 countries. He never had peace. The only time I saw him have peace is when he gave his heart to Christ. That's what made me think, yo, who's this man? He's changed. So I want to encourage you, regardless of how far you've gone away, close or away, God is saying, I'm waiting. And I'm going to rejoice. It says there, when he went to find the one sheep, all of heaven rejoiced. That's the beauty of the gospel of Jesus Christ. It's simple, but it's powerful. The fact that he shed his blood for you and I, even though we didn't deserve it. We were enemies while he died on the cross, and your name was in his heart. And that's powerful. I want to encourage you. It's a good news. That's why they say it's Ma'ayung Balita. It's the good news of Jesus. Lord, I give you my heart. I give you my soul. Where do we start? When do you turn on four-wheel drive? Basically, the quick answer is this. As soon as you're off the concrete road. The second you're on any surfaces that are loose, rubble, or wet, turn on. Okay, my Matic, big... Left hand, left foot, the you feather with the brake, yeah, right? Feather. So that you will not decelerate. You maintain the, the... All right, so right now we're just about to go into the how to operate the winch, setting it up on the front of your truck and your vehicle. Um, and the crew is just here watching how it's done over there. So let's go have a look and uh, learn a little something all about how to set up your winch on your vehicle and have fun with your toy. <laughs> anyway, let's go. This should be good. So, the winch is uh, free to engage. Come on, 
So right now we're just testing out the winch on their trucks so they can figure out exactly what to do when they do get really stuck. So as you can see, they're they're testing out the winch system on their trucks, which is important that you know how to operate your gear, right? All right, so we are just going on the maiden voyage. So I got my brother, Brian here. <laughs> going to he's, he's gonna make sure that we're safe and we're gonna drive this sucker. Let's go. We're just about to engage. Because look, I mean, he's only got all terrain tires. That, those aren't mud. Hey guys, you still all alive? Yeah. Okay, so we made our first patch. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. We've just taken a little stop. Um, we made the first phase. We're gonna go to a much harder phase now. There's gonna be a steep slope, 45 degree angle, and then uphill. So we'll see, we gotta help our brothers. Obviously, obviously this whole thing is about doing it together and keeping space from each other. The biggest thing today is reading the lines. That's really it. Pick your line, don't break hard. I did break hard at one point. I wish you could have seen it. The back side of the truck lifted. I then released because my heart just kind of calmed down after that. And we were good. Momentum is key. Feathering the brakes, hit it. Anyway, um, we're just chilling here waiting for the rest of the crew to arrive as you can see. There's some nice rides.
figure out the best line to get through this. As you can see, he's being winched out behind me here, right? So what we're planning to do is we're gonna take a line down the middle and over to the grass. Down the middle, over the grass, and see what happens. Let's see if it works. in the mud, had to get winched out by our own winch, which is cool. Some other guys were able to do it. Pretty good. Right, it looked like that left line was the best. So he's going right and then left. Mm -hmm. So you have to hit that. Hit this here. Thing. You hit here, then you hit there.
So check this out, right? So he was praying hard because he, he he let me have his ride, which we took, and it and it did good. We got through, right? I kept seeing Dennis in my mind while I was driving. <laughs> don't break it, don't break it. But that was fun. We made it first round, survivors and conquerors. Nice. <laughs> There's the man that we were following right here. My goodness. That's how you do it. So oh. we're awarding right now Hello. those that made the devil 4x4 Thank you, sir. The oldest member. Bless you. Brother. Bam. You killed it. Ah, there you go. Bam. Bless you. Brother. What up, champ? Bless <laughs> <laughs> you. Yeah. 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 That was the real deal. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. brother. Okay. The best co-pilot right there. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Champion. Champion. Yeah. Yeah. Bam. Yeah. 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 Oh, there you go, sir. Bam. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 Yeah.